Okay, so in our last kind of dealings, we didn't do too well against the uh, hordes of folklore people. This time, I went back and did more Goku training kind of schemes, battling against giant slug creatures, doing a couple of weightlifting sessions where I was lifting up God knows ridiculous ass weights that look more like glasses or something along those lines. No, we were just killing loads of creatures. That tank thing, by the way, was awful. However, let us get back to the road. We should be taking on the boss. What the fucking son of a gun? Yes, we should be taking on the boss battle round about now. Actually, you, you just caught my fellow in an awkward situation there, but we're gonna go, and this time, we're taking down those hordes of enemies in the traditional sense, as in, we don't need to fight these asses. We're going straight to the boss battle. I don't need any of your crap anymore. Screw this. Screw this all. <laughs> By the way, over there in the top, in like uh, the left side of the screen, see that floaty thing up there? Traditionally speaking, that's where you're going to find the fifth page if we're playing Keats. There's actually not a lot of pages to find if you're Keats. Right. No delays. I told you guys we're going straight for that boss battle. I just hope I know how to fight this thing. Yeah, that, that. Looks like something out of World of Warcraft. I think the gnomes made it. Those ghastly ass gnomes. I knew they were in league with the fairies right from day one. Let's show them what Horde can do to Alliance. If you're an Alliance supporter, then this is Horde. This is Alliance versus Horde. Whatever. Whatever. See what does. Okay, that's doing nothing. I think we're gonna just run away from this thing. Fire a. Yeah, cannons might work. Cannons are doing shit. We're actually getting rockets thrown at us, right? So, how are we gonna take care of this thing? Is that working? Oh crap. Okay, we've got our mark. We've got our mark. Just burn this badass. With our mega boosted thing. Dodge, dodge. How are you even meant to hurt this? I don't understand in any way how you meant to hurt this thing. We do drill. Drill does nothing. Drill back. Okay, I have no idea how to harm this thing. I thought I should shoot cannons at it, but it's not. Maybe we we don't attack this crap until it drops. Let's go with that. Oh Christ. Burn, baby, burn. Disco Inferno! Oh crap, 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 This should be a very simple battle. I wish our guy had telekinesis. Make the battle a little easier. Crap. Burn that oil cannon. Look, I'm pretty sure we've almost got him now. Look at that. It's all red and all that. That looks like a... Looks like it's pretty far gone. Yes! Let's turn that beast into a lava monstros- Okay, it's down, it's down. Oh my god, it spilled so much crap there. Alright. Now as you can see, we are so going to destroy its ass. We are destroying it. We are going to give it a new point. Ah, screw this. You know what? We're gonna get close. Busting its ass. Breaking everything. Getting through this goddamn armor. I don't think we need to. Oh, we do, we do. Most certainly do. Right, that's one leg down. It's another leg down, actually. Right, while it's on its knees, we're gonna break another one. Because I don't give a fuck. We are breaking every damn limb in its body. And we are doing it because we are gonna make this thing a cripple. Right, that's another limb down. That we can't damage. Let's finish off its final limb. Let's, let's break its damn armor. When it's got nothing left to rely upon, I'm sure we can then crush its tiny little minuscule brain like majority of people who are apparently in the military in this game. Because fairies are easy to beat. Thinks it can dodge. Look how that worked out. Right. Oh, crap. Did it fall on me? Let's do its head in. I think we've taken out everything else. Don't know what that is. Rapid fire with the axe. Did not work, did not work, did not work! Right, we got it now. 
Look, it's gonna drop in about three seconds. We've crippled all its legs. Yeah, we knew this shit. We knew this was gonna happen. Let's keep working that head. Give it a bit of head trauma. Actually, did that work? No, apparently it'll burn us right back. Burn us right back. Christ. Just realized how low our health is. Oh, Christ. Oh, Christ. We're gonna go into beast mode in about five seconds when this thing drops. Right, beast mode. Do not waste time, Skeets. We have to kill this thing. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. What? Mix absorption mode. The its movement changes in various ways. Try to predict how it will move and move your control accordingly. So this is a whack to the side. Whack to the side. Whack to the side. Well, I don't understand at all what we're doing here. We've got to... Okay, I don't know. It's gone into that mode. And... I, I can't see shit. Whatever. We'll treat it like it's the normal one. It's just two at once, right? Beat the crap out of it. Come on. I like to beat up giant leviathans for a living. You know, they used to call me Welber. Maybe because I was great on the game. But they, they also used to call me... What they used to call me? They used to call me... Hmm. What's the, what's the thing in Pokemon? What's, actually, what's the... What's that? Moe Dick. They used to call me Dick. Because I was an asshole. I don't know what you're talking about. We're gonna get this bad ass murder. We're gonna break his ass. We're gonna take him, show him how you fight a boss battle. Basically, we're gonna beat him like he was someone who made the mistake of thinking that we might be Argentinian. Actually, why is that? why would you beat someone up over that? That's quite a common mistake, maybe, in this situation. But whatever. We're just gonna we're gonna slam his ass into the goddamn floor. Come on, rapid fire. Yes. Yes. We beat another tank. Because tanks are for wimps. Is it still alive? What are you kidding me? We just killed this, right? Right? Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're, good. we're not so good. It looks like it's about to blast a cannon at us. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. And that is how you... What? This makes two. Who is talking? Fairy losses are mounting. They should have left it to Ellen. You look glum. Such a waste. Fighting a battle that cannot be won. A bit sympathetic of the enemy, are we? Just like ancient man, as I know him. And how would you know... I know, as I know the ancient Neverworld. I don't know who the hell you are. It's Lucifer. If you want to know, then work with me. But the scale of this is beyond me. Perhaps we can stop the grandiosity. Is that not who you seek? Is that Ryan? Nah, it's some other farmer bloke fisherman. They're quite common in the war zones. Terrible. Farmers always get drawn into the wars they're not ready for. You're the lighthouse keeper, Ryan, aren't you? Who are you? I'm investigating the incident 17 years ago. I don't want to talk about it. You remember a woman called Regine, don't you? What exactly did you tell her? Her husband and child died mysteriously 17 years ago, and she was killed recently too. Such tragedy in that family. They at least deserve to have the truth revealed. Yes. It was the night of Samarian. Harry and I went to the church graveyard. The lights were on in the church for some reason. That seemed odd. So we looked in. We saw Irv lying in bed. And Dr. Lester looking extremely upset. The photo was of that? Yes. Harriet took it with my camera. After that, 
she of ten she of ten commented on that picture oh it was horrible she said I didn't see anything especially unpleasant about that photo it was horrible for Harriet let me ask you then what did you tell Hervey's parents I told them what Hervey had done then why Hervey had died that was a few days after the photo was taken Irv was so happy the day before he said he and his father Renardo were going to the lighthouse so I told Renardo and his wife exactly what Harriet told me they turned ashen and left after that I don't know well after that Ronaldo fell over the cliff and died what in the hell did Harriet tell you anyway what happened to you personally no no we do not want cliffhangers All right. I'll tell you more but I have a little time on the verge of becoming a mes minimonos a giant snail Yes, but before I do, I'd like to ask a favour. I've just realised something. Could you please tell me, tell Dr. Lester that the fairy is back? What's that mean? And tell Harriet to forget the past and embrace life. Everyone else who's talking to the living. Hmm? No, wait! God damn it, man! Why is everyone turning to giant snails? Harriet, what are you trying to do? Now, please, let go. No, I cannot! You're mistaken. Dr. Lester had a heart of gold. Oh, no. Uh. I'm sorry precious photo. Don't worry, it was my fault as well. Ryan, I have an idea for you. Children have always liked you, yes? I want you to get the truth out of her. You want me to ask her? Yes, I will if it'll convince you. I don't know what you're after, but I don't want you to dishonor yourself. Thank you. But be careful. She may have a fairy guardian. There's more to this. I think there might have been messengers around 17 years ago. Where's everyone gone? Oh gosh, I guess we're going back to Doolin Village. I wonder why Livian contacted me. Bollocks to you, mate. Bollocks to you. Where do we need to go now then? Started with something Ryan Harriet saw at the church. I should pay a visit to Harriet's house. Yes, we should. Do we have time? We have time. To Doolin! We'll see what Harriet's been up to during the day. And that should hopefully end this chapter. Hurry, man! We need to find what's wrong with the woman. And why, oh why, what in the world has happened? And hope Ellen hasn't beaten us to it again. Gosh, this guy's just one step behind. Being a rebel is not an easy job, I tell you. Harriet's probably dead. Just going with assumptions here, probably dead. Let's see who was right about it then, eh? You've been doing guesswork all the way through this chapter. So who do you think is the killer at the end of this? Oh crap. She's alive. Mm. Guess I'm not always right. I met Ryan in the Neverworld. What did you see at the church 17 years ago? Well, you have been poking around. What did you ask Ryan to do? Ryan died where you should have. I'm not accusing you, I just want the truth. What did you say to Ellen? 
She is special. I just wanted to test my theory. Get to the point. That girl, Ellen, she was in the village 17 years ago. What? It will all become clear very soon. Not that many chapters in this game, is there? Save your game! People, we have successfully gone through chapter two. Thank you for being with me through the remainder of the Walkadia session. And you should, I hope you manage to stay with me all the way to the next session, which will be chapter three coming out probably next week or whenever you see it next. We do have a schedule to go by after all. Thank you for watching. Good night.